Hey guys, Kathy here. So this is my latest update on my teeth whitening experiment. This is how my teeth look now. Uh, let me get the light. Maybe you can see a little better. So I literally had my dentist appointment yesterday on Valentine's Day. The reason why I postponed is because I was switching my insurance and a lot of paperwork and once I got that established, I picked the soonest dentist day, which was Valentine's Day. But I really wanted to get the results as soon as I can to post the video and I was just really, really waiting to see what the dentist would say. So first when I first walk in, um, the assistant tells me, wow, if everyone had teeth like yours, I wouldn't even have a job. And I was like, really? You know? And um, she's like, yeah, they look great, you know? Um, and right now they're like a bright beige. Um, so then I saw the dentist. I asked her, um, so I kind of have been trying hydrogen peroxide for the past four months. And she was like, no, please stop that. It is not healthy. And let me explain to you why. There are good bacteria, good germs in your mouth and bad germs in your mouth. The hydrogen peroxide gets rid of um, both. It gets rid of the good bacteria as well. And that throws off the balance of the germs, that, the good germs that need to be in your mouth as well. So, and she said that the only people that benefit from hydrogen peroxide are people with severe gum disease because it'll stop the bleeding um, and that those should only be the, the only people that use it um, to prevent it. Um, and she doesn't like the idea how society sees that teeth that aren't bright white are not considered nice teeth, you know, she never, and she says, um, and she doesn't even have her teeth whitened, you know. And she's like, you know what? My teeth are bright beige and so are yours. And to me, that is beautiful, you know? And I was like, yeah, that, that really makes me feel good about myself, you know? Um, and I have no cavities. Um, she tells me that it's good that I've been flossing all the time, brushing my teeth twice a day, or even three times, actually three times a day before and after breakfast and at night. Um, and mouthwash is good and you can um, use a um, whitening toothpaste but she told me do not do that because um, side effects you won't see them right away um, and then I kind of got a little worried honestly and I told her well since I've been trying for four months am I still okay if I stop right now and she's like yes but you seriously do have to stop it um, it affects people that are have been on it for like a year or more and so that's what I got out of the dentist appointment and I truly believe that health is more important than appearance so this will be my last video on teeth whitening period um, because it's 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 not healthy like she said and I and the thing is I trust her because she's very passionate about her job um, and I would rather disappoint you guys, myself included, um, that it's not healthy than to tell you guys, oh wow, everything is perfect, go for it, and make you, just to make you guys happy, because I refuse to lie in an experiment. That's the purpose of experiments, to be honest on whether things work or not, you know? Um, and I do not regret trying this experiment at all, because I... Um, I had my doubts and I wanted to clear the doubts for you guys too and of course I have respect for all of you guys to the point where I would not lie to you about this uh, so because I could have easily made my dentist appointment up the whole story of what she said but I can't you know I was looking for an honest answer and as soon as I got it I knew I had to make a video ASAP to tell you guys so I'm gonna add like a little note to my past videos, see the last video, don't try it, um, just so everyone can know why not to try it. Um, but I don't think I'm ever gonna try that cornstarch for teeth whitening because I don't know, um, I just feel like it might get rid of the enamel, animal, 
I don't, I don't know how to pronounce that word. Um, but I really wanted to be honest with you guys. That's my, that's the whole purpose of the experiment. So my acne experiment worked 100%, you know. Um, but my teeth whitening, uh, by appearance it passed. But the health is more important to me. So I, it just overrules the passing of it. Um, and I would just say not to try it. So if you're currently trying it, stop it. And if you have not tried it, you don't start. There are other ways, but I'm, I'm, per, for me personally, I'm just not gonna look for any more um, things like this. Um, so I'm just gonna use teeth whitening, toothpaste, mouthwash, and floss. Um, so, like, you know, like how we used to do before all these teeth whitening things came about. Um, and, and you know, it's true what she said. Sadly, society does get us to think what we are naturally born with isn't acceptable by society. And sadly, that's the way things go. But, once again, I tried it. It was... A pretty bummer that it wasn't completely positive, but I would I w I'm really glad I found out sooner the better, you know. And I really wanted that appointment like really, 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 really more soon, but my insurance gave me all these problems. So with that in conclusion, now you guys know the facts about using hydrogen peroxide. So. It will be going back to the laundry room, my bottle of hydrogen peroxide. And so I will see you guys later. Take care. And I'm really glad I got all this doubt out of my mind. So have a great one, guys. Okay? Take care. Bye.